Celebrity Big Brother is back. I'm not the brightest of people. I don't have a filter. I am a lad's lad. I've got tit, teeth and tantrums. I've got a body sculpted by the gods. I am not going in that house looking for love, trust me. <sighs> when you make me see red, I will verbally assault you. Shall I exit now? Danan is back, baby. 15 shiny new celebrities Woo! arrive. Hey! Wow! It's ready for a party! I like to be calm, cool, collected, polite, until you get in my space. Oh, yes. And then it's a different story. And Sean was put to the test. Sean, Big Brother has a very special secret mission just for you. Right. You must transform into the most nervous housemate in the history of Big Brother. <laughs> Big Brother needs some singing, Sean. Something inside so strong. <laughs> Come on, with me. Something inside so strong. You know what I mean? You must make sure that Derek gives you a long hug. This is the coolest man in the house. Come on. Oh, God, I'm never going to rub off on me. Sean, Big Brother needs a longer hug. Big Brother needs a longer hug, Sean. Sean, it's time to get wet. I'm, I'm, I'm moving over here. Can you tip some of that on my face? Are we doing my tip? Please. Thank you. Thank you. Yeah, it's good. Thank you. Sean, you do still look a bit hot. Big Brother suggests that you get Brandy to pour a little bit more water on you. But Big Brother has got a surprise in store. Sean, congratulations. You have won a killer nomination. Oh. You can take your earpiece out and leave it in the diary room. Thanks for nothing. Dear one, 11.18 p.m. 23 minutes ago, the doors to the Big Brother house closed and 15 celebrities moved in. Early tonight, Big Brother set Sean a secret mission and his fellow housemates have been gathered on the sofas to find out what's been going on. Sean, earlier Big Brother set you a secret mission to become the most nervous housemate in Big Brother history. Sean, what you didn't know was that if you passed, you'd win immunity from the public vote and the power of a killer nomination, meaning that the housemate that you chose would definitely face the first public vote for eviction. He's going to hate this. Sean, Big Brother could see that you were acting nervously. However, you were certainly not the most nervous housemate in Big Brother history. In fact, Sean, you weren't even the most nervous housemate in the house tonight. Therefore you will only win half of your reward. OK. Sean, congratulations. You have won a killer nomination. Oh, my God. Oh, oh, that's that's not that's not that's that's the year begins. She has to nominate. So I have to nominate someone now? Sean, you must now deliver one killer nomination. Well, that's nice and easy, isn't it? Um, I don't really know anyone yet, so it's almost impossible. Whose names does he know? <laughs> He's going to pick a name he knows. I should have took this off. That guy with the monobra. That one, my name's James. <laughs> Sean, you should now state the name of the housemate that you would like to nominate, giving reasons for your choice. Uh, I will nominate uh, for the killer nomination uh, uh, um, Marissa uh, because um, uh, I just heard her say earlier that uh, watch out if you get in my space. So I suppose that made me a bit nervous. Hey, it's just a game, guys. Chill. Yeah? Life goes on. Life goes on. <laughs> Life goes on, yeah? Life goes on. Life goes on. Life goes on. Chill. Together we stand. That is harsh for the first. That is harsh, Sean. Yeah, well, they're going to do it to all of us. They'll do it to all of us. So all that rock and sandy, all that doesn't mean anything? Sean, unfortunately, you failed. So I'm going to take this earpiece out? You can take your earpiece out and leave it in the diary room. Go for that. Thanks for nothing. I don't take offense, it's okay. Let's party at the end of this, okay? Let's work together. You're picking on the young ones. Together we stand. Sean, I'm very upset with you. Sean, come here, come here, come here. 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 Come here,
Brother, it's not good. That's it. That's it. Okay. Well, they just show that. Sean, come yeah. here. Seen it. So does she know I'm nominated? Yeah, 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 yeah. come. No, so no, no, give her a hug. No, 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 don't feel bad. Come here. You please no, come no, here. I will. I will. I'm not upset. It's okay. Yeah. I understand. It's a game. <laughs> <laughs> I'm in an impossible situation. I don't know anyone. Particularly, don't know anyone from America. I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I can't. I can't apologise enough. I get you a drink. I'm getting ready to do these. Well, I thought you were the most nervous one. Thank you, Marissa. I can't apologise enough. Very hard. Okay. Well, that poncing okay. about was for nothing. No, I can't apologise enough. No, yeah, but we'll do. Like, exactly. Maybe it's because I'm young. You're maybe young, you're you beautiful. Know. Maybe you didn't speak to him. Maybe he looked at you sideways. It's a game. And maybe there's nothing there. There's but nothing also, there. you can't take it he had to make a decision. Right. And he chose someone that post said one thing that pissed him off. Yeah, let's go yeah. drink. You're yeah. not going anywhere, yeah. honey. You're a, you're a beauty. Oh, Thanks. Eleven twenty-eight p.m. Amelia is feeling thirsty. Oh, I love prosecco. I love prosecco. Lady fizz. Lady fizz. Lady fizz. That sounds dirty. <laughs> <laughs> Give me some lady fizz. Lady, lady fizz. Yeah, I call mm. it lady fizz. Big fan of lady fizz. <laughs> <laughs> I can tell what your mind like already. <laughs> Sean is talking tattoos with Sandy. I've got one. I've got one done just before you can probably see, oh, it, wow. see the that? outline there. It's a tiger Oh wow! wrapped around a dagger. I got it done just for one in the Navy so I wouldn't get picked on. <laughs> <laughs> that was, oh, God, that was She's eight, in the Navy? That was 18. Yeah, I was in the Royal Navy. I wanted to go as a helicopter pilot. It was just after the Thornton's War. I remember Prince Andrew had been a helicopter pilot. He had all the girls on his arms like cool start. And I thought, oh, that, that looks good to me. So I, um... I applied to be a helicopter pilot and got a place, and they found out I was colour blind, so they did all these tests. It's called an Ishihari test. They use green and is red... Is that a real word? Sean? Yeah, it is, honestly. Sean, whatever! That they use green and red lights. <laughs> what? But honestly, Ishihari... No. <laughs> it is. So they use this Ishihari test. Yeah. So they use these small dots of... a dot of green light and a dot of red light, and if they merge and I think they're, they're green, you're colour blind. If they merge and they're red, you're not. So they, they found out I was colour blind, so I couldn't basically couldn't be a helicopter pilot. So I ended up being a writer and I absolutely hated it and I ended up having to get myself. You didn't like writing? I got myself thrown out. Paul and Sarah are trying to settle into their new surroundings. Yeah, I don't really know. Right. I don't even know what to say you're to people when I right. first meet them. Right. I've been so secluded. I live in the country now. I've got my dogs. Oh, you moved? Yeah, I moved oh. out to the country. So, like, oh, I literally, I've been talking to my dogs for the last oh. fucking five years. <laughs> what, you there on your own? Yeah. yeah, more or less. Yeah, I've got a couple of friends in the village. <laughs> in the village. Tom or not? Uh, the ex. No. Really? Oh, okay. No, we broke up years ago. No, I know that. I just. We did. Just well, we did, but no, it's not. Yeah. Not really appropriate. Yeah. I'm not going to talk about too much of that on here. No, <laughs> well, you don't need to. But then there's been a lot of shit that does get said about me that's not even true. Well, maybe that's. Maybe what? Because when you say that, I yeah. don't know what that is. So maybe but, can, we can. But talk. no, because I don't want to. I don't want to bring it up because it's just. It's, oh, okay. It just plants seeds okay. in people's heads. Do you know what I mean? Does it? I don't want to bring it up and rehash it and try and. And explain myself. At the end of the day, people can see who I am as a person right. by watching. Right. And that's part of the reason I wanted to do it, really. Yeah. I know, I know yeah. that you had issues like I had. Yeah, but yeah, yeah. It, I mean, whether you want to say whether that was true or not, it's up to you. No, I think I'm a lot of that. Admit it. I, no, I think a lot of my issues were down to being in a toxic relationship. Ah, For yeah. me, it just stems completely from just being like just hurt. Sure. Six months before I was due to get married, it all just tumbled wow. around me. And, you know, I had to front everything, and then he fucked off to Ibiza. And I had nothing, and I, thought, I felt like I'd lost my family, my friends, that we had all built for five years. And, and I felt that I had no one left that I could turn to, and I was very, very lonely, and I just kind of, you know, I had, I had a few good select friends that, that helped save save me from myself, which I'm so grateful for. And they're still and good friends. Yeah, they yeah. are still good friends, but I don't get to see them very often. You know, I'm, I'm very much a private person, so for this, it's quite overwhelming to do this. But I'm, I just got so sick of people, you know, like, sort of labelling me, still, after all this time. I thought, do you know what, fuck it. Eleven thirty-three pm Jordan is very impressed with Trisha's look. I love your outfit, you know what? You have a lot of energy. I, I know, I do, I'm How sorry. How old are you? Older than a few. Are I'm you joking. 18? No, 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 I'm 25. 
What do you look? do? Reality TV. I'm a club rep in Ibiza. What are you famous for, though? That? <laughs> well, being a bit of a naughty boy, you could say. He's on reality TV. He does shit. You know, reality TV, like that. You do stupid things. I can tell. You're, like, extra. No, no, no. not extra. He's, um, he's a star. Yeah. But, like, you're extra. No, extra means, like, over the top. Oh, yeah, yeah. Well, you've got, you've got to be in Ibiza. You've got to be. Because I'm, like, a club rep, so I've got to basically... With my show, boys and girls come out on holiday, and I show them a good time. So, like, boys and girls come out each week. Take my beef, they're getting pissed. Uh, I, I feel like to slow down when I'm talking. I'm a bit more like, great. I'm, 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 I'm sorry, I'm sorry. No, I love it. You're, you're, you're a YouTuber, aren't you? Yeah. Mm -hmm. You're, you're, I love it. You are, yeah, you're very wild. You're crazy. No, me, I'm not at all. I just sit at home by myself. I don't even do anything. That's why I'm always by myself. <laughs> well, you shouldn't be by yourself. But, I like oh. to be by myself. I don't know why I signed up for this. I like well, to be alone. I don't want you to be by yourself, so I don't want to be around you. I don't want to be around you. You seem a well, lot. It's, I'm, it's <laughs> always kidding. good to be around a lot of people. Are you fun. a hooker? Am I a hooker? Yeah, like an escort? Uh, you, you said, no, you said you show guys <laughs> and girls a good time. <laughs> no, I don't want, no, ew, no. Because Europeans have skin on their dick, right? You're what? You're not, what? Europeans are not circumcised, right? No, I'm not circumcised, no. You all have skin on it. Not all of us, it depends. No, I'm, all I'm, of you. I've got, skin, I've got skin on it, no, I've got skin you on got it. you got skin on it. Yeah, 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 yeah. But you're not gay. No, 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 no. Oh. I'm a bit. I'm, I know I'm a bit lively now. Yeah, but you no. seem I like it. Where's the gay one? I'm always friends with the gay people. Is I don't there, know. Is it? We is need to find him. I thought you were. <laughs> Do you get naked on TV? Yeah, yeah. yeah. You show your dick? Well, yeah. When it's when it, when it has to be shown, yeah, yeah. And they show it? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's sort of. You know what I mean? But like, it's. You should do it now. Go jump in there naked. Right. Come on now, it's the first night. No, that's I'm like making an impression. Naked, yeah. Make an impression, do it. I, I don't need some of that impression, John. I'll do, you know. Drink some more and then you'll do it. <laughs> right, okay. I feel like you would. I would. If I had a dick, I would show it off every chance I could. <laughs> um, do you know where Wales? Do you know where this is? Gonna, do you know where Wales is? Yes, I I'm, do. I'm, well, I'm from Wales. I'm Welsh. <gasps> Are you from Pontypridd? My mum is. Yeah, my mum is. Tom Jones. Yes, see, yes, yes. So see, there we go. That's why I'm, I'm a Welsh boy. See, I'm from Wales. See, like Diana, Princess Diana. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So I'm from Wales. See, so I'm a Welsh boy. Well, I can speak Welsh if you want. Yeah, speak it. How do you uh, speak it? So I go uh, Borda, Jordan, the wing. Is that really a language? Or yes, you Welsh it up? has got its own language. Really? <laughs> got its own language. Yeah. If you're lying to me and making it up, everyone's gonna be fucking pissed at you. They're gonna think you're an asshole. Well, I will know Wales is a language. I think you're lying. Coming up. Marissa has a word with Sean. I don't regret what I said, and I do believe that if somebody were to be in my space and be disrespectful, you have every right to protect yourself. 11.44 p.m. Oh, my God. Oh my God. It's been 49 minutes since the celebrities entered the house. Oh, my God, how cringe, how cringe. I'm an actor. Just acting. Yeah, I'm an actor. I have a drama school. I teach. I'm an actor. Newly nominated Marissa is not happy. I am just like stone faced. Where's Sean? Oh, oh Sean. I, I agree. <laughs> Sean is feeling upset about nominating Marissa. But you picked, um, you know. Uh, because, I don't know. Because you had to pick someone. And, and then earlier on, she, she said, oh, I'm fine, unless someone gets in my space and then back uh, off, just being a bit sassy. Uh, but, but that's not... Yeah. nothing wrong with that. That's, no. that's good, but I'd like to think of something. I've only just, only just said four words to the woman. So there you go. So that's, what, that's, so that's brilliant. And you had an actual reason rather than just picking someone. You had an actual something to go on. So you had something to go on and it's cool. You ain't having a row, right? It's all good. <laughs> Jordan wants the law down on Marissa. It'd be nice to get to know the real you, because I think so far you've seen quite a lot. Well, what you see is what you get. I wear my heart on my sleeve, so I, there's definitely no hidden agenda over here. Well, I look forward to it. I look forward to it. Paul tonight, get it, Volson. Come on. Paul? Don't be shy. Come over here. No, 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 I can't interrupt. Come on, get it, oh, Paul. I'm not a cock blocker. Yeah, cock rocking, come here. What's happening, chat? Come on. I, I just, I'm feeling, I'm feeling like that we shouldn't make a big deal about this. I shouldn't. I, you know I, what listen, I mean? like I said, it's a game. Who knows? Maybe it was easier for him to put me on the chopping block because, you know, I'm from America or he doesn't no, know much about me America. or maybe I'm young. No, no was, not about America. You know what it was? It was exactly what you, your first instinct. What did I say? I don't even know. You what said to... about the space. Oh, about the space? Yeah. Yeah, but what's wrong about that? I don't know. 
right? <laughs> but that's that was what he had to go. He had nothing else to go on. I'm not sensitive, so well, cool. I'm not yeah. like, I'll be able to talk to Sean right now. That's yeah. not going to bother like, me. You, you took it well, because yeah, if that I'm was not... me, I'd have been fuming. Right. I'd be like, do you know what? Do you know what? Fuck this. Fuck I would have been kicking up. No. I would have like, fuck this. I've been in your half hour. No. Fuck Come on, no, let's not talk to Sean. I want to talk to Sean. I would genuinely be really upset. Yeah. Really upset. Wait, oh, if he would have picked me, I would have gone fucking mental. I want to spoke to the boy tonight. Do you know what? I said, you, yeah. me. Listen, I understand. It's a game. I'm I'm not a sensitive person. It is what it is. Okay? Yeah, I'm just so, so sorry. I, I would feel very awkward. You to pick a name out of the air. Yeah, I would feel very awkward being in that position, too, especially within the first hour. Um, it's very kind of you. Thank you so I'm much. Thank um, I just don't, I just don't know what to. But I don't regret what I said, and I do no, no, believe no. that if somebody were to be in my space and be disrespectful, you have every right to protect yourself. I, and that's I, why I said. I, was that the most memorable thing in your mind? Is that why you said yeah. it? Yeah, and, and that's a compliment. Is, 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 like, is that a good thing? Because you know. No, I actually admire I don't regret it. But saying it. I had to say something. Well, if you admire it, then maybe you should have picked somebody I, that. Uh, I, 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 you make, you're making total sense, but when you're up there and you've got the pressure to name a name, I just couldn't think of anything because then everyone was being so supportive because they thought I was being nervous and having a breakdown and that crap. But it was just really hard to. I guess I understand that. The name. I'm so I just can't apologise enough. It's just. Well, hopefully there's several people on the chopping block and. Yeah, well, there will <laughs> be. No, there will be. There will be. More than two. You yeah, think? yeah, yeah, yeah. Definitely. Oh, really? Four. Yeah, but thank you for. Thank you, for, thank you for coming over. I'm not over. sensitive. It, means it is lot, what it is. It, it means a lot to me for you coming over. Thank you so much. Yeah. It means a lot, and I hope to get to know you better in the next few days. And uh, Likewise. If we make amends. And if I make it, I swear to God, you're going to do it all again, right. Okay, right? no, no, no. Sure. <laughs> all right. Eleven fifty-five pm Sarah and Marissa are getting to know each other. I'm maturer than my age, you know. How so old are you now? Sorry, so thirty-two. You're thirty-two. I am. So I look younger than what I am, yeah, you know. But really. I've been around the block way more than the next person. Mm. And uh, I moved out at nineteen. I had a child. You know, I was pregnant at twenty-two. Had a child at twenty-three. So wow. you no, know, I pretty much did it on my own. You know, most of my life. I mean, I can't wait to settle down now and just have a family. And I got duped when I was thirty, and six months before my wedding. Oh really? Yeah. And that that just like, that broke me. But you know, every day is a new, new sort of opportunity. You've yeah, just got to exactly. think of it like that. You know, sometimes you might fuck up, but you know, life goes on. It always does. Just got to move forward, and that's what I started doing. You know? Yeah. Oh, mm. <laughs> Honestly, if you ever want to chat, guys, you know, I'm always here. Jordan has a question for Chad. Are you single? Yeah. Yeah. You? I am single, yeah, yeah. I think yeah. Place, you've got to be single. Paul, are you single? Am I single? Single, ready to mingle. I'm, I'm uh, <laughs> ready to tingle. I'm with the mother of my child. <laughs> You're with the mother oh, of your child. <laughs> so You're not single. <laughs> no. That was a weird. That was a weird answer. <laughs> <laughs> he, he didn't, like, he didn't like, want to say no. And he didn't want to say, say yes. So, oh, 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 You're so me to the mood. I don't yeah. understand that. And you're with her. Yeah. All right, sweet. Just kind of like, guys, just make your moves yeah. fast because you know what? Yeah. He who hesitates yeah. masturbates. Recently single, though. You broke so. up with your girlfriend three weeks ago. Yeah. Okay, cool. I've been Close. single for a lot too long. Yeah. <laughs> I've been single for that long. It's depressing. Like, same old shit. Especially after this shit happens, you're like, how do I fucking choose? <laughs> you go through your DMs, you're like, brrr, brrr, brrr. Yeah. I like you that know what I'm talking about? <laughs> well, I mean, not, probably not as many people sliding as my DMs as yours, but no. I, get, I get dudes. I get dudes. <laughs> I like cock shots, man. That's all I get. <laughs> I, get I get nothing else. You get a lot of cock shots. I get yeah. a lot of girls soaping their asses. I don't know how they're holding the phone, but they're soaping in the phone. And I'm like, what? Why is it the, wow. the thing? I'm, it, it's all right. I'm like, I'm not gonna not watch it, but I'm still like, mm, cool. Everyone has got strong personalities, haven't they? It's a big, yeah. strong personality. That's it. That's yeah. It. yeah. That's yeah. Right. Right. But in here, it, it's all about personality. If they've got a shit personality, yeah. you're not gonna They're get on with it. your mind, man. You don't I give a shit. But it is all about personality. But I didn't yeah. know you. I'd be like, fine, but I know you. Oh, I should know what's yeah. up. I thought you were boys. Okay, what, man? But isn't it? We're going top to tail tonight. The girls ain't got good personality. You're gonna get bored in here, aren't you? Twelve twenty a.m. Sam is in the diary room talking to Big Brother. Hello, Sam. Happy birthday. Ah, is it my birthday today? Is it like twelve? What do you think? Is it? Yeah, it's twelve o'clock. Come on! It's my birthday. I actually don't like my birthday though, but it's what I'm twenty-five. 
Oh, but big brother, it's my birthday. Mwah. Yes, 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 yes. Oh, God, weird. I'm not going to lie, it's weird, but I'm so excited. I'm so excited to, like, just sort of get involved. Everyone seems super cool as well, but it's going to kick off, isn't it? It's already, like, Sean nominated mob, mob wife lady, and, like, she's, like, she got a bit angry, and then, like, Sean felt a bit bad. Day one, Big Brother, day one! That's my birthday present right there. Day one, we've got beef. And then, like, day three, I can't wait for day three. Or day four. Everyone's going to be, like, losing their minds. Gemma is checking out Chad. You're so tanned, by the way. Why are you tanned? Tanned? Because tanning bed. You know? Okay. <laughs> Why are you so say? tanned? You're more tanned. Same than... reason. But you've from been the in... tanning bed, yeah? From the tanning bed. That's a good accent. <laughs> Let me try and do yours, like, from the tanning bed. Wow, well, that's crazy. Like, that's an accent. That sounds like I'll do it a little more. Did, okay. did I do it good? That sounds, yeah. What should I say? say? I'm gonna drink a beer and go to the beach. I'm gonna drink a beer and like go to the beach. Well, holy shit! You sound Should I so... do it good? Yeah. That's, <laughs> see, that's so weird to me that like, like is it's it you really? faking an accent. Because it, it sounds to me exactly like you're I'm I'm just like, like oh. I'm from like the OC. Oh, holy shit! Is that... <laughs> For a second, I was like, wait a minute. I thought you were. <laughs> <laughs> do your English one again. Yeah. So I, I'm loving the champagne. I love some fucking champagne. That's like a bit Send me some tea. Well. <laughs> no. Have a cup of tea, please. Why is there no tea in the champagne? <laughs> <laughs> when is there ever tea? Fuck off with the champagne. <laughs> do you know what's so funny? Whenever people do a British accent, they always have to swear and be angry. Because even I accidentally raise my own voice sometimes. Do you? Why? Well, I don't know. When I get energy or when I'm drinking, I'm like, yeah, let's fucking eat it. You know what I mean? Like, you just involved. like, yeah. But like, if, 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 like you actually talk to me normally, I'm like, yeah. Yeah, um, I really do. Yeah. We just... are we are training, by the way. Cause I want to train. I want a big ass. You want a big ass? A big ass. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's pretty easy. I want the fat booty. <laughs> <laughs> Coming up, dangerous Danan causes chaos. Is it this? No way. Oh shit! Sorry. Oh no. Fuck. Sorry. Sorry. Twelve fifty six AM. The celebrity housemates have been getting to know each other all evening, and Brandy has noticed Jordan's dimples. So I have to tell you this right now. Both my kids have dimples, and so does my ex-husband. So I'm saying this. I just have like, a soft spot for you. Oh. Like, just in a, like, a cute, like, I'm going to look out for you way. Yeah. Do so you know what I mean? <laughs> She's got mother me quite a lot. Yeah. She's, all you get is mother of bigger and mother No, exactly, because I can't, because you're so cute. You're oh. adorable. <laughs> Chad wants to know more about Amelia. How old are you? You mind me asking? I'm 22. You're 20. Oh, fuck, here you are. Wow, you're probably the oldest, youngest person here, yeah? I think I am. How old are you, Chad? Oh, you think I am? 30? That's probably. Oh, yeah. Like, next week I'll be 30. I look a lot older than I am. I used to smoke and drink a lot more. So, 29, but. I like an older man. Oh, yeah? Yeah, I do. Okay. My last, my last partner was 29. Partner? Yes. Oh, wow. That's... My last partner... My last partner was 21. <laughs> oh, really? Okay. 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 Gemma and Trisha are talking about love. Yeah, but I can't like, oh, fall in love with a girl, do you know what I mean? See, I'm the opposite. Yeah. I fall in love with a girl and he gets the sex. Like, I, like, I'll, like, like, I'll like, pursue it. I can't like, get down with a girl. You yeah. can't. See, I can do all of that. Really? I wish yeah. I could, because I think I would be happier with a girl. I just think sex is harder for me. I can do all the sex, and I just can't I can't love them. I'm like, OK, like, can, as soon as I have sex with them, I'm like, can you go home? That's how I feel. It's bad, isn't it? No, but I, but I, I get it because I'm confused as well because I'm just very yeah, much like attracted to girls. I like mm -hmm. relationships with girls better, but girls sex is hard. I'm the opposite. I get a fall for men, and I always date girls who fall for me faster, which is maybe why it puts me off. I yeah, yeah, that makes sense. That's so interesting. Mm -hmm. It is interesting. I'm still like working stuff out about myself. I know I want to be with a man at the end of the day, 100%. You do? Yeah. I don't know. I'm, I'm very confused. Are you spiritual or? Yeah, I'm, well, I'm actually very religious, but like spiritual too. Mm -hmm. What's your, what do you mean religious? What Catholic. Do you Catholic. Very Christian. Like I used to, I used to be really bad. Like, 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 I used to be really bad.
It's, awful. it's not a bad like, thing. It's, it's a job. It's, I don't think it's a bad thing. It's a bad thing for me. Mm -hmm. It was not good for me. But and then I found God and Jesus. Yeah. And, like, and did you, that you helped you get out of it? How long did you do that for? Seven years. Yeah. Seven years. Yeah. 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 But it's dough, isn't it? It was so much fun. Okay, and it was hard to walk away from. And it's still hard. I used to do stripping. So I made so much money stripping. You don't do it anymore. No, 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 no. Why did you stop? Um, because I only did it really to sort of get by while I was modeling and I'm a hustler. I like to make money and I like to be independent. I want a nice car, I want a nice house, I want nice things, obviously, and I want to get them myself. And then I did, did better in modeling and did TV, so I don't need to anymore. It made me more confident, though, actually. Me too. Yeah. Me too, 100%. Because you're like, oh, these people like, want me. Because <laughs> I'm really insecure, so I was like, wow, people are paying to like see me naked? Like, yeah, it's so good for your confidence, isn't it? Yeah, yeah, I agree. So did you do escorting and stripping together? I started out stripping and then I did escorting. And escorting is just more money. Yeah, but bet it is. And less time. Less time. Well, depends. Okay, but yeah, before time. you're good so at what you did. Yeah, yeah. it was great. And in LA, you get to do celebrities, so it's great because you get to meet people you love. That's hard even escorting if you get to sleep with them. Yeah, it's like fun. It's like fun. And it was fun. And then, like, morally, I was like, oh, this feels bad. You know what I mean? Yeah, of course. One twenty a.m. Big Brother still hasn't opened up the bedrooms and Helen is feeling anxious. I don't want to share with anyone. No. Um, I don't either. <laughs> I feel like the girl should but, have to. But if I have to, then I that's one of the many challenges here. It would just be so fucking weird yeah. to I suddenly can't. be sleeping in a bed with someone you've never met. I, I would not sleep. It would be weird, yeah. would it not? And then I have an IT, so I'd have to get my pants on. <laughs> and then you just go, oh my God, that would be really yeah. weird if I just rolled and touched someone. I mean, yeah. when my husband or you woke snores, up spoon in them. <laughs> yeah. and when he snores, it irritates me, I kick him. And, um, to do that with someone you've just met? Yeah. Because that's my habit. Oh, fuck. <laughs> Making a noise. <laughs> so and then yeah. that would be awful because that's what I do. Right. Sam and Jordan are sizing up their housemates. But what, 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 what are your opinions on Gemma? Would you go there now? Lucy. Gemma yeah. Lucy, yeah. She's like, what about her, though? I was going to say, I thought, like, when, she, when I came in, I was like, oh, she's going to be, like... I was like, she's going to be bad shit. I was, yeah. like, I was like, I reckon she's going to fucking throw something against the wall mm. within five minutes. Yeah. And she actually didn't. Like, she's actually super chill. Yeah. Like, but I feel like she's holding back. I think, because what, from what I know of her, I feel like, yeah, she's holding back. Yeah, she's always I can't wait until she opens the oh, mouth. I can't wait. I'm waiting for yeah, yeah, yeah. popcorn medals. And it will happen as well at but some yeah. point. You smell it, smelling the bottles. Gemma's thirsty. No, I was looking in it. <laughs> Why don't you... What do you smell it from? Looking in it. What are you guys drinking? Just having a shit. Oh, just we we've, we've concocted. Grease, yo. What the thing? Put your bag around. Well, I said put my bag around there. No, I'm bringing my come bean bag. So what's what, up, Gem Dog? What's yes, Gem Dog? Gem, I love that question, S Dog, right? J Dog. We, we're, we're, we're no, we're Jam. Oh, we, yeah, we're called J Jordan and Sam. Yeah. Jam. Jam. What about me? We, we're well, right come now. on, you've got, you've got to be welcome to the crew. This yeah. is well, what, what does it take? Well, right. you got a penis. You got to have. No, yeah, yeah. <laughs> right, Jem. Who are you fancy at the minute? You must. Yeah, have yeah, yeah, yeah. Jokes. I, I, I don't. I. For me, it's personality. I don't know anyone. Oh, you well are enough. both. Right, the if you had to pick fucking lies. <laughs> I said Marissa. Yeah, she. Hot. But then that. She's um, hot. She's scary. Said. She's scary. I want to die when so I'm next to So, Jem, who are you fancying so far? It must yeah. be somebody. It's, it's going to be. Must be one boy. Yeah, yeah. I don't fancy Chad. Why? Why do you not fancy Chad? What do you mean? Aggressive, what what is it? It? <laughs> no, no, what it wasn't is aggressive. But is it? How did you know? What is it? Why? Well, because I just, I think, I don't know. I just don't think many girls actually will. I feel like his vibe's just a bit too like, cocky. Yeah. Okay, I'm not so very good with so the ladies, them, but them, I know the ladies. So, <laughs> right, right. The That's the bar the of the day. The house, is on, the house is on fire. Your legacy's left with one lad. Shut up. Oh, would you choose? On a serious level, come on now. We're just drinking. I was like, yeah, come on, Jim, we do. Probably one of you two. Do you know what? Jam. <laughs> jam succeeds. Jam. <laughs> One thirty-eight a.m. Brandy is in the diary room telling Big Brother her thoughts on Chad. Chad is a boy man. Chad is um, lost and kind of, I think, his head is in this bubble of fame and he is all about, I'm the big guy, I'm the small, like, it, it's just, he doesn't really know him yet. I really like Chad, I think he's a cool guy. I don't think that he needs to beat bad Chad 
and be this guy that people want to not like because he's actually very likable. I just think that he needs to kind of rest with himself in his own headspace. It takes a lot for you to like cut loose loose, doesn't it? No way. I'm totally fine. Yeah. I'm fine. Because you're like kind of cutting loose. I can see that. I guess like to an extent, like I'm not sloppy. Right. You know? But I love having fun. Okay. Life is fun. Just enjoy it, you know? But do it in like a respectful manner. I don't like to Right. I don't yeah. like to be sloppy, you know? I'm not I'm not the butt of a joke. Yeah, for sure. Because once you do that, you, you can't I don't know. There's some people where you can't come back from that. I guess in some time, in some way, I'm reserved, you know. Yeah. But I'm not afraid to go outside the box. I've been out there. It's safer because you do. You meet people and then you do that and you try and have fun and you try and be friendly, and then they look down upon you for like you having fun, and then all of a sudden you're like, well, fuck, like. I opened up because I liked you, and then now I can't because you know, I'm never going to do it again, all because you're judging me because of that. So it is safe to do that. But yes, majority of people are extremely judgmental. Did you, uh, did you go to the diary room? Hey, Jealous, you want to go up? Wow, well, I mean, it's kinky, huh? <laughs> it was a bit. Dun, dun, dun. Sorry. Sorry. I got called in. I'm going to do it now, but I'll be oh, okay. I win. Are you good? Skepta, is it this? No, why? Oh, shit! Sorry! Oh, no! Fuck! Sorry! 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 This is Pete Twitter. Would all housemates gather in the garden immediately? Oh, no! I didn't mean to do that! This I did it! I'm sorry! Don't worry, housemates. Pete Twitter has everything under control. It was a mistake! Would gather in the garden sorry! Immediately. I'm so sorry! Garden! Oh, shit! I pressed the fire alarm! Oh, I, could already be right, I thought it was the right. diary room door and I pressed the fire alarm. I thought the, the thing, the button was next to the actual diary room door. And then when I pressed it and then it just kind of um, made this crack noise like 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 it it broke, it snapped like the plastic. And um I was like, shit, that's the alarm. And it, well, it, went, it was, it went off straight away, didn't it? Um, so sorry. It's my first dangerous thing. <laughs> that's why they call you Dangerous Danan. It is why they call me Dangerous Danan. And I do dangerous things without even wanting to be dangerous. It just follows me. Like, some people probably call it clumsy. Coming up, Chad is feeling very confident. They're all hot enough for me to date right now. If you said, like, who has a better chance of getting a girl on a date, it's going to be me. Two or five a.m. Big Brother has decided to let housemates into both of the bedrooms, and Brandy is the first to claim a bed in the Blossom Suite. Randy, do you mind if we go next to you? Worst idea of my life. Oh, you're so comfy. Wait, wait, wait. wait, wait, wait. Are, you, are you big on little spoon? I'll be whatever you want to be, bro. Oh, <laughs> sweet. I like being little spoon. Yeah, that's fine. Oh, that's big spoon. That's oh, awesome. Big spoon. Yes. yes. Right. We have the best room, by yeah, the way. Yeah, by far. Oh, we've got Sean. We've got Sean in the house. We've got, we've got Derek, Derek in the house. We've got Derek and Sean. <laughs> oh, Derek, you've got, you. you got to tell us ghost stories. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yes, yeah, 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 yeah. We all know ghost stories. Oh, no. Ghost yeah, yeah, stories. Randy, you say that. She said that being like, I need some room. Derek, can we do some ghost stuff, please? Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Get in! 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 Get
What's the, how, what's the situation next door with beds? There's no beds. Do you want... Not even doubles? There's none. To be honest, right, I just didn't want to be in the crazy, crazy room. Yeah, like, who, who said, oh... Like, you know, like, the, yeah, you know what I mean? And, and I kind of actually quite like the forest room because I'm a bit of a boyette, so... <laughs> this is the forest room. That's the girly room. I'm not really I'm, a girly I'm cool. girl. I just, I, d I just think this room seems like a bit more like we're going to get a bit of sleep. Right. Yeah. I need sleep. Yeah. yeah. I like me sleep. Yeah, me too. I'm, I'm going to probably share with you, and she's going to take this. Absolutely okay? fine. Whoever wants to do what. No. You, no. no. Shut the fuck up. Hello, no. we're young girls. We, you, you just carry on. Do you can either share with me or you can have your own. You got the choice. I don't yeah, know what to well, do now. I'm moving over. Uh, um, Helen, are you next to me now? Do you mind if I shoot this side, though? Hey, Helen, you um, know, wait, well, Helen, wait, wait, Can I sit this side, babe? Do you mind? Yeah, whatever okay. side you want. You have this bed. I've got nothing in it. Okay. There you go. Helen, you're in the cool room. Next to my I, love, face. I love the way we don't have <laughs> any fucking problems <laughs> in our <laughs> share in bed and shit. It's just so easy. Marissa, would you, like, unzip me? Yeah. I'll unzip you. My God, the relief of taking heels off is like... I have no... I don't even have socks. Earlier. It's not like we were going to be like, hey, you know who was cool? Amelia, until she took her fucking heels off. <laughs> like, bro. I would judge. I was about to hit on her, but then she took her fucking heels off. Like, nah. What happened? Yeah, me, me is... I'm just going to get into my... See you, guys. Yeah, yeah. mate, room's fucking... Wait, no, you're saying here, yeah? I don't even... Who's, who's it? Sandy's there. Sandy, she, she was cooking and she asked me to find her a bed. I, I, Simple as that. I can't sleep with a lady. Derek, mate. Oh, no, I'll, I'll sleep with a guy. Derek, stay. Derek, I like you to stay, please. Yeah, that's right, mate. But I can't sleep with a lady. Why? Oh, you, you, you kind of can. Okay. No, maybe not, actually. Well, ah, uh, but. Uh, well. Uh, no, you cannot no, have him. No, I'm just asking If I can't you. have him, you can't have him. I'll, I'll go to the next door. I can, you know, lie Where down the next to man, yeah. It doesn't I matter, it's okay. No, I understand that, Derek. That's, 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 that's a okay. Call. That's understandable. Yeah, yeah. All right, then. Derek. I'm going to miss you, Derek. Have a good rest. I was looking forward to ghost stories. I'm meeting you. <laughs> I want to go to bed, yeah. OK. <laughs> I'll, see, I'll see you soon, <laughs> eh? Oh. OK, guys. Three or four a.m. Gemma is giving Carthic some advice on how to handle confrontation. At the end of the day, I fully believe that if you confront someone, that's the best way to deal with something, right? Hmm. If you confront, how else are you going to deal with a problem? Sort it out, get it out. Yeah, I'm not going to whisper to you about him. I'm going to tell him or her, whoever yeah. it is. I just don't. And that's that. Mm. You know, straight up, it's finished. But a lot of people. But people can't take it. Hey, you and I can take it. A lot of people. Tomorrow you got here, to run. Hey, you, you know what, Carpet? You know what, Kay? You know what, yeah? Done. Done. And there's yeah. respect there. You know, but there's respect there. A lot of people there. in here would rather bitch or talk to other people and not tell the person directly because they don't want to confront. Because even though that was sorted out. Correct. But because they are not as strong, maybe. Yeah, maybe. And that gives, you know, you have to have but respect then, for those people as but well. Then, it's always going to come out in the end, so you might as well just go choke the person and confront. I Correct. just, I think. It's... But you are at strong of the heart. Yeah. I am Maybe too. I need to learn However, that people are. I can see where the other people are because not everybody is, you know. Not everybody is. To say that this is the right way, do you see it's the right way? Why don't you do it the right way too? It's like they can't, man. They can't. Mm. They just can't. That's why you have to be a soft. And I learned this the hard way because I used to talk to those guys like I talk to you guys. You know, like mm -hmm. blah, blah, blah. The yeah. thing is, they can't do it. They can't. I don't get it. I wish that like, I maybe I need to learn that other people aren't as confrontational. It's as about me, just putting ourselves in their shoes, you know. Yeah, that's about. What, that's what this experience is about to me. So that's that's. I think yeah. what the experience Cheers is all about. That. Cheers, man. Exactly. Marissa is talking to her Big Brother about her killer nomination. I mean, it's just a game, right? It is what it is, no hard feelings. He remembered me saying, um, if anybody gets into my space, there's going to be a problem. But I don't regret saying that because if somebody does get into my space in a disrespectful manner, that is going to be a problem. I don't hate Sean. I think he was put in a really tough situation. I don't know. There could be a, a lot of reasons why he chose me or, you know, singled me out or, Maybe, I don't know. I mean, a lot of people keep saying, oh, you're so pretty. I don't really think it's looks that makes one 
pick someone, especially coming from a man, why would a man choose and single out a female because they're pretty? I don't agree with that. Um, I don't know why. I don't know why and I don't really care. It's a game, so I'm not singling anybody out. I'm gonna give everyone fair game until they show me something wrong. I guess you're gonna have to wait. Three forty-eight a.m. In the forest suite, Carthic wants some Derek time. Now I wanted to talk to you. I love to play karaoke games. Maybe tomorrow outside in the garden we will yeah. talk about it. You know? Yeah. And I don't, and I cannot. Let me tell you, at will draw spirits to me. Oh yeah. Happen. Yeah. I don't want that at all. You can't summon the spirits. No one can conjure them up or bring them in or say, hey, a command or demand does not matter. I don't even want spirits. I want your knowledge of them. That's all. Oh, yeah. Like, You've got oh, an inquiring this... mind, haven't yes. you? Yes, I'm curious. You're all right. Yeah. Very interesting. Very interesting. Not a problem. This is so nice. I'm in Big Brother. That's right. Oh, my God. That's right. That's right. Are we Big Brother? <laughs> the big brother yeah. in the UK. Yeah. Been in the UK 12 years. Got my passport six years ago. Look at me, man. Wow. Yeah. So happy. So happy. So content. Yeah. In the Blossom Suite, Jordan and Sam are talking about Sean's decision to nominate Marissa. Yeah, I know. When he said Marissa, I was like, come on. I don't fucking believe it. You are a failure. Oh, your face is just like you. I get shunned by everyone. <laughs> and you've ever got that tag. First vote. <laughs> Chad is talking to Big Brother about his female housemate. You know, like when you look at the girls from like the outside looking in, you know, first I'm like, yeah, whatever. You know, like I kind of saw their like headshots at like who the people that I thought would be here. And then you get here and you talk to all of them and it's like, ooh. Don't really know which one to shoot for. They're all hot enough for me to date right now and I'm liking each one of them in separate ways. So normally I just choose a girl based upon like, oh, this girl fits like who I think is hot and I don't get to know the other ones. But you know, it's like each of these girls is like different in their own right and I'm down to date each of them. According to everything that's happened so far, I feel like the girl, every girl that I've talked to is pretty open to it. You know, I haven't overtly hit on anybody. I've just been getting to know people. So, like, yeah, I'm interested in basically every girl here. I mean, not like the old lady. I mean, like, she's awesome, you know. But, like, they all seem pretty fucking open to me, too. I mean, have you been watching? Looks like they're open to me. Do you think you have any competition? Um, no, not really. The guys in here are all pretty cool. But, um... We are just beginning kind of these relationships with everybody. So there may be a dude that another girl likes more than she likes me. But at the same time, who I am and what I do is going to work out better from the start than it is all the other guys here. Maybe they like like some weird quirks or some shit like that. Or like some type of personality characteristic that I don't have. So maybe they like the other dudes. But all I know is like right now, if you said like, who has a better chance of getting a girl on a date? It's going to be me versus everybody. You know what I mean? Like, not being cocky, just, I'm just saying. You know what I'm saying? Ex-celeb housemate Kelly Maloney talks about her brush with death next in brand new celebrity botched up bodies. Then at 5 past 11, the icon that is Sue Pollard joins Rylan for Celebrity Big Brother's Bit on the Side.